Hey, what's up guys? Kanigis here and I'm bringing you big, big, big news in the Bioware and Mass Effect community. Now, the lead developer of the Mass Effect trilogy, Casey Hudson, has left Bioware. Let me read a little bit of the article. Alright, so Mass Effect 4's development team just just lost a key member. Bioware announced today that the series executive producer Casey Hudson has left the company. He said, quote, after what already feels like a lifetime of extraordinary experiences, I have decided to hit the reset button and move on from Bioware. Casey also said in a letter to his co-workers, and quote, I'll take a much needed break, get perspective on what I really want to do in the next phase of my life, and eventually take on a new set of challenges. He also said, quote, Though there has never been an easy time to make a change like this, I believe this is the best time for it. The foundation of our new IP in Edmonton is complete and the team is ready to move forward into pre-production on, on a title that I think will redefine interactive entertainment. Development for the next Mass Effect game is is all is well underway with stunning assets and playable builds that prove the team is ready to deliver the best Mass Effect experience to date. And the Dragon Age Inquisition team is putting the final touches on a truly ambitious title with some of the most beautiful visuals I have ever seen. Now, Hudson has been with the Bioware company for over 16 years. He began as a technical artist on the M MDK2 and Never, you know, uh, and Never Winter Nights. He served as a project director for Star Wars Knights of the Old of the Old Republic. He is most known for the leading development of the original Mass Effect trilogy, however. Um, so, there you go, guys. Now, the reason as to why he left is really unclear. Okay, yes, he said that, you know, it seems as though he, he left voluntarily. But some people are speculating that maybe, maybe he was giving the letter or a layoff or you know a two weeks notice I don't know a month's notice or something like that that he was gonna get laid off and you know he just wanted to spend as much time as he could before he left you know that's what people are speculating me personally I feel like he is too important in the Bioware Mass Effect community yes he did have a hand in the Mass Effect 3 ending because he was the lead developer on it of course EA pushed everyone to you know fail but in Casey Hudson being the leader you know uh, it was his choice to make the ending what it was so yes it was his fault but if you look at the rest of the game one two and most of three except for the ending of Mass Effect 3 I'd say he did a pretty damn good job you know I, I, I feel like he is too important to even to for them to just fire him like that you know I think that maybe he just got tired of all the BS that the fans and just the people gave him I mean he's been in he's been in the business for 16 years maybe you know he's looking into other development studios or something like that I mean who knows what he's going to do he wasn't clear as to what he was going to do you know but um, you know people and also myself is are a bit nervous and uh, a bit skeptical of this new guy the new lead developer has not been announced yet but people including myself are, are skeptical whether he actually knows what he's doing now if they're gonna pick a lead developer to replace Casey Hudson he of course has had to be working close with Casey Hudson and the team to fully understand what is going on I'm pretty sure he's in he's on in the loop about everything that's happening about the development about how it's going so I feel like this new leader will be very well educated as to how to how things are gonna go of course he's gonna add his own ideas into it I'm pretty I'm pretty sure but hopefully it will not hurt the Mass Effect series as a whole and it will not hurt this new Mass Effect I hope it won't you know I you know I, I'm hoping and praying that this new guy knows what he's doing. I'm not gonna say that he doesn't or that you know it's gonna fail or anything like that because it it would be stupid to predict the failure of this franchise, you know, because we don't know what this guy's capable of. All we can do is speculate, but I don't think it's fair to just say that it's gonna be a disaster, you know. So 
But anyways, guys, Casey Hudson, he has done a very good job, except for the Mass Effect 3 ending. I don't, you know, I don't think that he really deserved as much flack as people gave him. I think EA deserved most of the blame because BioWare is a subsidiary of EA, and that means that EA can tell them what they can do in the game. That's right, EA can tell BioWare this is what you can put and this is what you cannot put. That's what it means to be a subsidiary, meaning you are owned. You are completely owned. But anyways, guys, that's my take on it. Hopefully, this new leader that they will pick over the development of Mass Effect 4 knows what he's doing. Hopefully, he will, you know, stick to how it has been. I mean, nothing wrong with adding anything new as long as it doesn't fuck everything up. I truly hope. But anyways, guys, let me know what you guys think about this about this news and the new developer whoever he is you know just let me know your thoughts in the comment section Kinegas out